Ah, I wasn't sure if you'd be foolish enough to come aboard, Jedi. But I can sense your presence. Did the docking starship clue you in as well? There is darkness surrounding you. It's meager compared to mine. Come to me, Jedi. Stand in the shadow of Malakor if you can. Tell me, Jedi, what was it like when you struck down a master of your own order? Was it as you imagined? You can't hide behind your minions forever, Vivacar. I will find you. And then what? The battle is already fought, and I have won. Really? Because I'm almost positive I'm still alive. If you need me to remind you of that, honey, just ask.
your power and tactics have got you this far, Jedi, but no further. This battle was decided before you stepped aboard. I'm tired of your delusions. Explain yourself. My plague isn't just a disease. It siphons power from its victims. With the proper rituals, that power can be channeled. Soon, the combined strength of your masters will make me the most powerful Force adept who has ever lived. If you love the Force so much, prepare to become one with it. You can't defeat me, Jedi. This face, this Vivica, he is just another skin to be shed. Parcanus offered himself to me on Malachor III to crush the order that destroyed us. He embodied my spirit. I am no lost Jedi, no ordinary Sith Lord. I am Terak Morage. A Jedi healer put you down once. Now I can finish what he began. No one can oppose me. I am beyond flesh, beyond death. I will crush you, Jedi, and your shattered body will fuel my rebirth! Impressive, Jedi. You might even have triumphed, but my victory is already complete. My plague has spread farther than you can imagine. Jedi Masters across the galaxy are succumbing to it as I speak. The plague binds these Masters to me. Hundreds of them. The heart and soul of your order. You've had thousands of years to think up that story. Then why hesitate, Jedi? Kill me, and you will kill every master I have ever infected. Everyone. Shielded or not, they are still bound to me. But what choice do you have? You cannot let me live, and I am deathless. Your shielding talent cannot harm me. You've lost. Your mistake is thinking I care who dies. We felt it. A massive shift in the Force. We have reports from across the galaxy. Dozens of Masters have died from the plague. Maybe hundreds. The plague is gone. And so is the true Plague Master, Tarek Morhage. Morhage? So this threat was even greater than we knew. Thank you for all you have done. The Jedi Order owes its survival to you. Please, return to us on Tython. We wish to thank you in person, and we have a special reward for you. We've been awaiting your return. Please, step forward. Thanks to you, the Shadow of the Plague has been lifted from the Order. There's a title reserved for the most prestigious among us, whose wisdom and skill safeguard the galaxy. It hasn't been bestowed in thousands of years. There were objections, given your methods, but we must acknowledge the debt we owe. Therefore, we name you Barsenthor, Warden of the Order. How many Jedi have been named Barsenthor? In all our millennia of history, you will be the third to carry the title. And not a moment too soon. We have need of you, that the Republic is facing a new threat. I stand ready for anything, Master. We need time to prepare a war council. The Supreme Chancellor himself will be attending. Take time to rest. And you should record your journey in the Jedi Archives. History must know of your actions. Return to us when you feel ready. 
For now, the entire Order will know there is a new Barsenthor among us. Nothing like a well-deserved reward, eh, Jedi? It's no luxury cruise to Corellia, but still, that's quite the title you have. I feel like I should curtsy. I think we've earned ourselves a little time to relax. In your dulcet tones, that sounds even sweeter. Well, without Vivicar's minion sounding us, the galaxy is vast and wide. Shall we?